take our arms. I walk over to stand next to the base. I position my foot slightly below the hip. I take my foot upwards to get a bend in my hip. And slightly take my weight over the base. And I straighten my legs and provide some support with my hands. Okay, we take our hands and the hands in the grip. It's important for me not to bend in my belly, but actually in my hip. I lift my foot upwards, which actually already creases my hip here. Then it's not really a big jump, it's just a lean. So I lean forwards. And I push up. did not jump at all. It's just lazy and hanging around. Keep this leg really relaxed and keep tension in your upper uh, side of the body. My position in the side star, I am always able to see the tips of my toes. Um, I'm trying not to be in a banana shaped this way, but rather to have a slight little tension here in my belly with the toes forwards. From here, we can try to go down into a straddle bed. It's very important for the flyer to really pike a lot here. I also have to bend my arms slightly, otherwise if I keep them straight, I will just push Yasmin's hand into a really uncomfortable position. So I go here. To get out, I have to increase the pressure on my arms, but always in the direction of the floor and not in any other direction. So really tell your flyers if they push you out of line with their hands then it's very important to first use your leg as a flyer instead of just your hands. It's really amazing how much weight you can already shift with just using your legs. You can also try from here. Replace your hand onto the leg of the base and always think of this leg pulling towards the floor and this leg extending. To dismount, we take our arms, the base slightly bends their leg, and I come to the floor very slowly. There's a few things that you can think about once you got the hang of this movement. We often see people when they do this exercise that at some point they do funny things with their arms, but also with their hands. So they go in a position like this, they just forget about having a nice platform here. So maybe start thinking about this. And another thing is basis, think about your legs. I can really help my fly a lot by slightly bending this leg and then extending again. Same here, I bend and extend. I bend and extend. This really pushes me in the direction I want to go without me actually having to do any force. So as a spotter, I'm just near the flyer being prepared if anything should happen to catch her always uh, on her head, preventing her head from falling on the floor.